Hello, my name is Michelle Griever and I'm a family doctor at the North York Family Health Team. I've been asked to talk to you today about improving care. What do I think about improving care? Well, for me, to do better care, I need to measure what I'm doing first. That means data, because if I don't know what I'm doing and how I'm doing, I really can't improve it. I'll tell you, um, Health Quality Ontario measures care. Um, one of the things that they've measured was access to care. Can my patient come in to see me the next day if they're sick? Well, for HQO, 40% of patients said yes, they could. For AFTO, 59% of patients. So you can see that AFTO members actually do better. For another thing that's important to patients, like patient experience, does my doctor spend enough time with me? Health Quality Ontario, 82% of patients said yes, my doctor spends enough time with me. For AFTO, 87%. For another important measure, like colorectal cancer screening, for Health Quality Ontario, 58% of patients said yes, I've been screened. For AFTO, 64%. So these are things that are important to our patients, they're important to us. And what's nice about D2D is the first version, D2D 1.0, was so successful that now I think AFTO has decided to go to D2D, D2D 2.0. So there's going to be additional measures that are important to teams, to care providers and to patients. So look for that because there's going to be a little bit more. So why is it important to send this data? Well, because it makes a difference to patient care. But I'm busy. My team is busy. This is actually something that's very easy to do because this is information and data that is already being measured. There's no extra work. The only thing that's being done is to add it uh, to a different tool so it can be compared to data from other teams and other care providers. So my team's large. I don't expect a small family health team in a rural area with very few resources to have the same data, the same statistics as we are. However, if you're a small team um, somewhere in rural Ontario, there's other teams just like you that are submitting data and this allows you to compare yourself to your peers. So sometimes people tell me, well, we just have bad data in our EMR. We don't know who's diabetic. We don't know who's got high blood pressure. You know, it's all a big mess. It doesn't matter. Start where you are. When you start to measure things, because you'd like to submit it to D2D, you're gonna find out very quickly that, hey, my data's not perfect. Well, guess what? Improving data is improving quality as well, because you want to know who your diabetics are. So figure out a way to improve data. And as we continue to do this, our data will collectively improve. We will be able to measure more. We will be able to submit more data to D2D. And over time, we'll collectively improve and because we're going to be collectively able to compare like patient to like patient. I'd like to know how my diabetics are doing. But first, I have to have the data to show me who these people are. And that means better data. So no worries. Start where you are and over time, Make sure that you improve your data because that's important to the care of your patients. And guess what? I think your colleagues, the other teams, are, help, are here to help you because we're doing this as a group, a team of teams. And that's what AFTO is all about, after all.